Uh, oh. Well, hello there, cutie pie. Uh, I'm not Dunk. I mean, I'm uh, not drunk. Yeah, that one. <laughs> so, you come here often? No, but this demilitarized ghetto is so charming and vibrant. Look, you even get a souvenir rat. Look at him. He's a little baby. Huh? Oh, no. See, I was on a tour bus for a football game here. College pro quarterback. <laughs> yeah, I'm that guy. Mm-hmm. Anywho, the boys wanted to hit the bars, maybe pick up some ladies to enjoy while we're in town. But I'm a lightweight, and I guess they dumped me here with Pickles. Pickles is a rap, by the way. Aren't you, buddy? Yes, you are, tiny baby. Hotel? Yeah, somewhere. I think it's called the Fleetway. You're really pretty, by the way. No. Damn, you're strong for being so much smaller than me. Just helping me right up, huh? Oh, fine. Be free, Pickles. Live to bite another day. <laughs> Healthiest relationship I've ever had. Yeah, I'm a total pushover. Too chill, I guess. I just wanted them to be happy, you know? It was, it was my first relationship with another guy. And I guess I was kind of hoping it'd be more chill than my previous relationships. But, man, he was like ten times as demanding. Used to get so insanely jealous when I just talked to my own teammates. Man, fuck college, you know? Sorry to vent. I appreciate you listening and all, but you look really sad. Are you okay? Damn. Yeah, I can see. Why you'd be feeling down. I can't believe he dumped you like that at a party he invited you to. In the dead of night. In a bad neighborhood. Man, where does this guy live, huh? I'm gonna go punch his dumb face in. No? I can fight drunk. I'm a champion at drunken fist style. Like... I only saw it in a fighting game, but I'm pretty sure I can whoop some ass. <laughs> okay, I'll take you laughing over whooping some ass with my mad skills. What good is being a big dumb jock if you can't rush to the aid of beautiful strangers? Pfft. If jocks bullied you in high school, then one, fuck them. And two, they were totally sweet on you. Trust me. We're very simple creatures. Like, uh... Zebras? Yeah. We run around and beat each other up and talk a lot of shit, but... If we see someone we like, we turn into total idiots and, like... Kick them in the head. Okay. Metaphors aren't my strong suit. I'm trying to sit down and read some classic... Ugh. Literature to figure out what the fuss is about. Reading uh, Pride and Prejudice right now, and let me tell you, I seriously am sick of Elizabeth and Mr. Darcy. Like, holy shit. Get over yourselves, right? Oh, that's, that's the point of the book? Oh, 
Oh, because they have to get over their pride and prejudice. Dude, I get it. Whoa. Damn, you're so freaking smart. And you're, um, really cute in that shirt. But it kind of looks like you're shivering. Here, take my jacket, okay? No, honest, it's fine. I'm not making you uncomfortable, am I? There you go, hmm? Why did I ask if you might be uncomfortable? Well, this is gonna sound dumb, but... Without jocks tend to be dicks, I've met a lot of people that assume the worst of me. Or... Or were even afraid. I'd really hate to make you uncomfortable. Uh, aside from calling you cute, I can't quit that. I'm glad you think I'm funny. <laughs> it's dumb. When the boys were working their magic at the bar, I was just sat there wondering what it'd be like to meet the love of my life in some strange town. They'd be sweet and funny and really, really cute. And they'd be having a bad night and we'd find each other and everything would just... click. That's so corny, right? <laughs> My jacket looks really good on you. Man, I was really enjoying talking to you. Yeah. Hey, um, do you maybe want to come up to my room? Huh? For sexy times? Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. No, that's not what I meant. I just, I don't know. Wanted to keep talking to you and maybe cuddle and... And I just realized how dumb that sounds. Fucking hell. I'm so sorry. Yeah. I'm on floor 12. Room 115. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Everything's kind of spinning. Hey, if I barf on you, but we still get together somehow, can you make it sound like a cute story for our future? theoretical kids I really don't want them to know that I barfed on you in a non-cute fashion yeah this key card is just butts man come on door come on dude don't make me look dumb in front of this cutie okay like, whatever, keep your secrets, but I really want to sleep. Oop, there we go. I guess sleep was the magic word. Hmm, bad. I love you, bad. Hmm, bad. Hmm, thanks, cutie. You're a keeper, you know? Yeah. Mm, good night, sweetie. Mm. 